Math fans and bakers have celebrated Pi Day, observed in some parts of the world by consuming and throwing actual pies. The day has also been recognised by the US House of Representatives. Apparently. I think it's such a fun, silly holiday. It's the one day of the year that brings together math enthusiasts and pie aficionados. March 14th, or 314, corresponding to the first three digits of pie, a mathematical constant with a never-ending sequence of numbers. It's also one of the busiest days of the year for bakers, who say pie day is always big business, with folks looking for any excuse to give themselves a sweet treat. It is awesome to have a slice of pie, a little reward for doing your work on a day that otherwise would be any other day of the year. But we get to celebrate Pi Day. But for some folks, it's all about the math. 3.14159265358. Pi has always had a certain mystique. Mathematicians have been working for thousands of years to extend the sequence of numbers. And for some, Thursday's annual recital is a badge of honor. So it's something about how my brain processes numbers, and I feel very lucky to share it. But some are using the holiday to highlight the benefits of STEM education and raise money for it, including the nonprofit group Peace of the Pie, which partnered with the Arizona Science Center, hoping to bring the magic of math to the next generation. Having an opportunity to build positive relationships with science, with their family, so that we can build a pipeline of critical thinkers. And this isn't just a made-up holiday. Congress officially designated it back in 2009 to encourage more interest in math and science. And yet, I have no pies here at the desk. We need to change that.